Welcome to part 8, testing multiplayer movement. So let's build and run this and see how it looks. So I'll join as a host here, join as a client over there. Okay, so I can see that the network motion is synced and I'm not controlling uh, the other player either. So the script is responsible, this code is responsible for ensuring that we're only controlling our player, the one that belongs to us as defined by the network manager, and the network transform component. So if you look at both the players, they're both there in the scene. The network transform component is what is actually syncing the motion across the network, and the send rate controls that. So you could increase that for, I guess, smoother sort of motion, but that's more data across the network. And if you've got lots of players and other objects moving, then you really want to keep that down. So Unity doesn't show us how to do smoothing uh, in this tutorial set. I guess it's a more advanced topic. So hopefully in the future, uh, they do come out with something about that. Okay, so move on to the next video where we'll uh, just make each of the players more unique. Like you'll see the color, your player in a different color. And well, each client will see their own player in blue color.